welcome back to the channel today we're gonna be making bread pudding now this right here that I poured in my container is whole milk I would say roughly around three cups of whole milk now you can use the box whole milk or you can buy the powder and add water to it because that's what I did then I added a cup of sugar brown sugar and I'm um, whisking after which you're gonna go ahead and add quarter cup of melted butter now what I realized with the butter that I used it crackled so I guess my choice of butter for this one um, I didn't like the fact that it crackled but it still did the job and it worked wonders so yeah so I'm just gonna be whisking then I'm gonna be adding two eggs mix the spice cinnamon powder vanilla and almond essence no i'm not going to give a specific measurement for those because i use according to what i like so if i add it and then i don't like it it needs more than i'm going to add some more so yeah so i'm not going to give any measurement for those because you just add according to your taste what you like okay I am now going to be adding some condensed milk to it. Now I like to add my own little touch and the condensed milk does that. So I'm adding the condensed milk and then I'm going to whisk. After which I'm going to be adding nutmeg because after tasting the liquid I realized that there's still something missing. I added more spices but something is missing and then I'm like oh wow I didn't add any nutmeg. So I went ahead and I grated maybe around a teaspoon of it or a pinch. And then adding it to the mixture and after doing that I realized that yes this is what was missing so I added the nutmeg and I'm gonna be pouring the liquid the liquid <laughs> evenly over the bread pieces now I bought I think it was a two pound bread and I had um, brown bread on my fridge top and I just added it to the bread that I bought and I cut up the pieces in boxes or cubes <laughs> and uh, yeah now I'm just pouring the mixture as you can see the butter is all craggled I, I think I, I chose out the wrong butter for this but next time I will know that I will not be using that butter so yeah I'm pouring the mixture over it I'm, I want to make sure that all the pieces of bread gets so and after which I'm just gonna bake I'm gonna bake and trust me guys this turned out amazing oh my god like guys you really need to try this recipe you should smell what's happening right here you should smell it like it's really simple really easy it's, it's really affordable try this and you'll see just what i'm talking about